Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to Red Flood. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lova. And right now, I've, I fixed up uh, some things off screen from the end of the last video. We got some comments to go through. But as you can see, um, we did really well. So let me tell you how we got here on March 24th, 1940. So uh, I was much more prepared this time. And put my armies around here, around the demilitarized Venetian area. And then we went in here and made a little encirclement right here. Cut, went in here, boom. Cut into here, and circled a few divisions of here. Went through Trieste, came over here, and circled the divisions of here, and then just bum rushed a Fiume. And then they capitulated. Then I threw all those guys that were on the Fiume border, these guys, over to this part of Benghazi, of Libya, just because I was losing North Africa because I couldn't hold it. Because we saw in the last episode, our, our tanks really suck. So I just converted the other tank division to motorized. So it should do a lot better. So then we came over here from Libya and moved all the way west and took them all out. Took a little bit of time, especially taking out uh, Algiers and Oran. But as you can see, it's been done. And I and I almost never do this, but I even invaded Corsica and took back Sardinia. So yeah, and we're struggling here a little bit. But right now, I'm getting our guys back here just so that... We can use them for naval invasion, because we're definitely going to need them for naval invasion. As you can see, we're attacking here too. And unfulfilled import requests are from Persia. How sad. Uh, Citric Haspia. Thank you, thank you. And, ooh, outdated equipment, huh? We're trying to get a carrier. Supply-wise or equipment-wise, we're doing okay really well on guns. We need more artillery, motorized, and sport equipment. But I've also done the other focus off-screen, expanding the forces. Oh, what's something else here too? Oh, this stuff. Expand the military forces, we shall drown the enemy in bodies. Pretty nice. And are doing incentives to share. Or serve. It'll take a lot to encourage people to join. No matter. No matter. We lose some consumer goods, but we get more, a lot more population. And for this one, we lose stability, but we get more defense on core territory and more population. Wow. Let's do construct arms factories next. Expand the military factories. So we can arm every man in a growing army with the newest and best equipment possible. Sounds very good. We're also war economy. We're on limited recruitment or conscription. But right now... What do you think is better? <clears throat> Beretta, when you get more soft attack and defense for infantry equipment, or Breda, when you get more artillery soft attack. I love the artillery soft attack, and you get more breakthrough, which is pretty nice as well. Um, oh, I'm going to decide here, but let me know your thoughts. Is it better to get more soft attack for artillery, or is it better to get more soft attack for guns? For right now, I think I want to go with uh, this one, just because I like the breakthrough as well, but what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And as you can see, we're trying to attack here as well. Um, oh, casualties. We lost a lot of guys. Like, don't get me wrong, we lost a lot. But the French have lost a lot of guys. Look at that. 673,000? That's a lot of dudes gone. They still have a lot of manpower, though, so. I mean, it's not like they're really defeated yet. Really, they're going to run out of equipment before anything else, so. Please, just make sure you save this guy. Uh, also, I combined, I think, most of my fleet together, right? Yeah, I did. Just in case, because I don't want to lose any ships here. I really don't. So, hopefully, we win here. We should be able to win here. And since you guys are down here. I'll go to now. Let's go daddle you guys over here. Because as soon as we start landing, um, I actually might just throw all you guys into this group. Yeah, maybe. Hmm. Do that. You know what? Let's do that. Combine them together. We got some recon companies. It is 1940, like I said previously. Radar would be good, but let's get some atomic research because nothing is, says happiness like in a nuclear Italy, right? And they'll probably still attack, 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 attack. Hopefully no one else really wants to go to war with us, but you never know, you know. Oh, I can only have 10 on these guys, so it's just fine. Oh. Oh! You guys are still down there, huh? That is not ideal. I immediately won Turkey. Well, good luck with that. Do not die too much. Um, and you guys are set to convoy escort. Yes, escorting convoys. Hey, look at that. Two subs have been sunk. Very good. Oh, that does not good. We lost some convoys, too. Oh, that's not good. You know, you can't win every single one of them. Can't win every battle. Um, go do that, too. Are you guys good to go? You guys are pretty much there. All right, give them a few more seconds. <clears throat> Hopefully, we can destroy these stupid little subbies. Ah, subbies. Oh, we lost a guy. Oh yeah, you got hit really hard. Give him about a few more seconds. He'll probably get enough equipment, anyways. All right, insert to serve. Construct arms factories. Very good. I don't want to send him over yet because he just needs a lot more strength first. Um, there you go. Well, maybe not. Oh, uh, when are you gonna get your stuff? Well, let's try to do it anyways. Let's see what happens. Hopefully, our guys can destroy these enemy subs. This, this is getting ridiculous. Cancel the lend lease. That kind of sucks. If you can go in, that'd be great. We did land. Okay, then. Nice. And they're attacking us as well. Now that we have two ports, that is very good. Throw everyone in there. As long as supply doesn't get too bad. Do that as well. 
And now I want you all to start th thinking convoys. Um, you're gonna go convoy, 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 raid. And you're gonna do that too. It will also sell that sucks. Anything else? Anything else? Three more subs have been sunk. Very good. Let's see the out attacking quite crazily. Um, you guys actually might be able to push out now. Do that because these these guys are gonna move their divisions as well. So that'll be fine. Throw more guys into here because we're gonna start moving out. La Vittoria indiscutible. Breakthrough in the Alps. Few may occupied. Headline after headline proclaims the glorious success of the Italian arms. The French are utterly disorganized by a manly advance, and there are rumors that the Red Huns have put their forces on the French board on high alert. Sensing this danger, the French government has offered us rather generous terms to surrender. What? They will recognize our possession of the territories of the Regency of Carano, and will see to us both Alta Savoia and Tunisia, and in exchange we will demand no indemnities and vacate the rest of the lands. Furthermore, the Escadron will offer a 200 to 10 gun salute to the Italian flag, and the king will be given three works of art from his choice from the Louvre. That's actually really nice then. Though we will not have the satisfaction of marching to Paris just now, there is no doubt that this is a great victory. Denuzio's little bandit kingdom is crushed, France is humiliated, and Italy's reputation as a great power is now unquestionable. We have some hard work ahead of us, to be sure. The Carano must be properly integrated into the nation along with the new territories, our armed forces must be re-equipped, and we must digest the lessons of this mercifully short war. However, that is tomorrow's work. For today, let every church real being church bell ring, that every village and town celebrate. Eat well, dance and be merry, today it is one. Italia infine tutelmenta redanta. We get peace? What? Maybe Corzo, I like that. I want to kill them off more, man. I really do. But, eh, it's alright. We've had enough losses. That is, well, that's not too bad. That could be a lot worse, actually. That could be a lot, lot worse. Um, I'm going to switch to General's run as well, because I do want to switch that out. Um, hey, at least we got, hey, we got the territory. I, I think that's great. I think that's really, really great. We, that was, that's very weird. This is one of the weird times where we actually have a, a peace deal. <laughs> that's very weird to say, that we actually have a peace deal. Are we still at war? Hold on. Okay, now I think, there you go, now, now we're not at war, that's good. Alright, so you guys did really well. Um, do that. There you go, separate both of you guys. Or, I guess all you guys. Go and repair as well. When you're done, repair. Italy thrashes the League. An epic turnabout, the Kingdom of Italy has successfully defended itself from a joint attack from the League Solar, successfully retaking Fiume in the process. France has offered significant territories to Italy in exchange for an end to the hostilities, and just Germany seems poised to take advantage of a weak in France in 1940. Military and political pundits across the globe are shocked at Italian military effectiveness after a mixed performance in the Great War, and the widely recognized culture of corruption and nepotism that had been integral to Italian high command. As Italy celebrates, policymakers around the world are changing their plans to accommodate the expanded role of the Kingdom of Italy, which will doubtlessly play in world affairs. Italy won. Life really is stranger than fiction. No, that's not strange. No, no. Oh, look at that. Sit Romana Potens Italia Vertula Propoga. Virgil. Um, I'll be honest. You know why we won? It's because we got the Pope on our side. Because as the thumbnail has stated, as long as you have God on your side, no one can beat us. Well, maybe except for the other gods, but God is with us. But we must not become too confident in our victory. Also, we did get this, of course, which is actually extremely nice. It doesn't, we don't have that many more factory slots there, but that's actually really, really nice. Getting more um, uh, stuff there. Really nice. Alright, so now what? Construct arms factories. Total rearmament. Uh, 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 we're already on work. Oh, I, I guess we're already on work, aren't we? For glory and nation, I guess. For glory, for God, for the nation to serve today. Why not? Cool, looking pretty good. And we do have other carries we want to make down here, too. So, um, I guess expand dockyards now. I mean, that was really good. Companies would be good as well, but, though, but... Um, you know what? We can use these more quickly anyway, so... Let's do it in... Oh, we can... Latium. We can do this one now. Last time we couldn't do it. So, very weird, but okay. <clears throat> Some comments. Someone recommends we try... Uh, Nitis? 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 Uh, Italy? Yeah, eventually we probably will. Total rearmament. Let's not pretend we see peace. We're going to fight, and the nation shall be ready to wage war. Uh, let's see, Nitis, Liberal, someone wants, uh, oh, it says, okay, so qu quite a few people actually want me to play as a Liberal, uh, party under Niti, the Partito Radical Italiano, sometime, sometime, not sure when, but sometime, so yeah, we'll get there eventually, we will, yeah, <clears throat> not bad though, really not bad, I wonder what, what else this has in store for us though, ah, good, good, 1940, there you go, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, but yeah, we will, eventually, Italy is kind of crazy, and someone did say this is Italian wild rides, but you know what? We like the wild rides. Skill level 4 is not too bad. Not great. I prefer iron sides, but whatever. 
I'll get there maybe eventually. Maybe. We'll see. And for glory and nation. Ah! France! Are you are you sure you're ready for that? <laughs> Let's not pretend we're, we see peace. We're going to fight and the nation shall be ready to wage war. Yeah, that's... Uh, did you not see how many... How, how much we killed off so many of your guys, France, and equipment? But secure the frontiers. Secure the borders. Make sure our enemies know exactly what we own and that we are ready to defend it. I'm, I'm scrolling out right now just to see if there's anything else here in terms of equipment. As you can see, we got a lot of air XP. Holy crap. Yeah, I just... I don't know. Oh, is that lag or something? What can, oh, we're on the uh, naval map mode. We don't like these guys. I don't really... I really hate those people. So, can we help you guys out? Um... Hmm... Isn't he so handsome? Look at him. He just has uh, he just has that smile. Paul Joseph could never do anything wrong. Right? Right? <laughs> uh, how many planes can we send? Um, that was Berlin. Excuse me, game? There we go. Well, well, let me see if they'll say yes first. Or maybe they said no. Ah, uh, they probably said no. Yeah, darn it, my bad. Uh, yeah, they pushed out a little bit, I guess. Yeah, they do a lot of manpower still. But a lot of equipment was just destroyed. I don't know how strong Germany is right now. Free trade, volunteer only, oh, war economy, so, yeah. Thank you. And, 1940 stuff. Oh, get better cans, yeah, we definitely need that. Total rearmament. So then after that, the Ticino Ultimatum. Oh. Yes. I don't even know how strong our divisions are. How strong are these guys? Did I make them good? We made them well. Oh, yeah, that's actually really good. Nice. And we are on Grand Battle Plan. Something different than Superior... I think we're on Grand Battle Plan, right? Different than Superior Firepower. Yeah, we are. Infiltration Assault's Grand Battle Plan, so... Don't always want to use Superior Firepower. I'll use it most of the time, but not all the time. Good. S-I-M. Sim. Cool. Um, is there anything you... Let's go to the Lion. I think that's the Lion set. Or this is the Lion. Whenever I see this, it always... I don't know. Because, I don't know, maybe my eyesight is really bad. It looks like a lion's head with sunglasses. I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> oh, it goes parts of China. Oh, are we done building those... Oh, wait, hold on. Are we done building that stuff already? Wow, we built them like in two months. That's pretty nice. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, we have maxed out fuel, so... Let's get some of our civvies back. And actually invest in a little bit more steel. Don't trade with those guys. Don't trade with those guys. Revolution in Japan. Um, you know what? Let's trade with Revolution in Japan. Why not? Just because... Uh, they're, they're just a little crazy. They're just... They're just crazy. Uh, Romania, Iraq... Man, if we get to Iraq, that'd be really cool. Oh! We have too much of this already? Okay. Thank you. I just want to save. Make sure we can have enough stuff to build. Just want to build, 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 build. There you go, too. Nice. Thank you. We got... Do we really have that much... Or t Not bad! Not bad! So far, Italy's a lot of fun. And I made these guys 40 combo with, just in case, for the future, so... If we need to change them out, I mean, we're good to go. Uh, we have four divisions here that are something else. What is this? They are 40 gun with. Nice. Very cool. Helps with supply consumption, night assault tactics. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We've got a few more divisions here to share the love with. Goodbye and thank you. Got a third army too. Nice. Italy's getting stronger and stronger and stronger. We love it. He's kind of a general, but whatever. The Tensino ultimatum. Tensino's rightfully Italian. We must demand his return as soon as possible. Cool. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, why not? Nice. We're gonna get that guy. Let's at least get a second operative as well at the same time. Alright. Expand the dockyards. Yes, please. Bread up. Very good. Very good. Artillery. We could do some anti-air. We might as well do that, but since we are here anyways, what are we making? We're we making tactical bombers for this, for this campaign? No, we're making cast. We're making a lot of cast. So. Battlefield interdiction? Oh, battlefield support, I mean. Trade, trade interdiction is a naval doctrine. Oopsie. Secure the seas. Italy's naval power must be unquestioned. It must be completely secure. We rule the seas. Oh, looks pretty good. Better invasion prep time, amph amphibious invasion speed, more planning speed. Oh, talk yards, yes. Then to war heavy holes are just not really worth it, in my opinion, right now. So, I'll uh, grab one more of these. We could grab two, but go, go one. We still need to build stuff anyway, so. Uh, oh, actually, no, screw it. Go another one. Screw it. Why not? Trade with the good old Japanese. We still have 15 and 7. That's not too bad. Keep building, 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 building. We need more rooting 
party popularity support. I keep thinking this is a stability, but this is stability. 72% is not bad. That's pretty good. Anything over here? Oh, 50. Uh, encryption would be nice. Oh, but even less. Oh, but less supply consumption. Slightly less. As well as better decryption. Let's go with that one just so that we can decrypt enemies' stuff more quickly first. Batista. Faustino. Faustino. Matteo. Let's go with Matteo. Bomber Department. Demand the Balearics. Operation of Bonapat. Subjugate Albania. A coup in Athens. Oh. Actually, we could. They are fighting the Germans at the same time. I'm not really sure. How, how, how weak is Germany? How weak are they? Are they really that weak? I, I know they're not Prussia, but. How weak are they? We could get rid of the Turks, too, huh? Hmm. We might get rid of the Greeks, though. Trying to invade the Greeks. I don't know, man. I kind of want to get rid of the French again. So. Operation Bonaparte. Operation Bonaparte is insane. And many of our armed forces say, but it might just work. Wait, so what happened with the Tensino thing here? Are we just giving up on it or something? Or um, 1940s stuff. 1940s. 1940s. Uh, planes? Yeah, planes. That'd be good to do. Can we have Tensino or... Well, it's a claim state, so if we do this now, we'll always have it forever, so. If not, I mean, I just, I guess we'll prepare for the French. You know, what What happens? <clears throat> Excuse me. If we were to allow them to die, and then we invade France, then we get Germany under us as well? That'd be kind of nice. They still have a lot of divisions, don't get me wrong. But if we can push fast and hard enough, we could probably do pretty darn well. Especially with 40 combo with divisions. That's pretty nice. Not gonna lie. Both of you, go right there. But I lied. But an occasional lie is okay, right? There you go, good luck. Let's make sure everyone has some stuff here. Operation uh, Bonaparte. I just want to see what that does first. After that one, we will go ahead and do Albania. I like the Albanians. Albania is a position of massive importance. We must secure it before anyone else does. Oh, no ships. Oh, we have a, oh, we have a carrier. Oh, boy. A carrier. I'll put you on the kind of the weakest group. There you go. All right, let's go here too. Very nice. We could do this stuff, but eh, we will need that later on. But I want to focus a little bit more on these guys first. Not bad, really, not too bad. Build, 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 build. Only 115 factories. Yeah, Italy so far. This one, this Italy is kind of fun. Kind of fun. Not gonna lie. We definitely need more planes, though. Um, interwar bombers. I guess we're trying to use those as well. I guess we don't really have enough military factories. We only have four on infantry equipment, which is not very good. But whatever. 1.28 every single day. Belarus, clear one Russia. That is... Aussie Republic. What the heck? Also, other comments included, um, apparently in the Cold War Iron Curtain mod, which I've never played before on the channel, at least at the time of this recording, Israel has a unique focus streak. i got to get to other mods, man. I really do. I, I really need to get to other mods sometime. But, Albania. Question of Britain. And then a coup in Athens. Or should we do a not an inch? No, I'll do not an inch for the Turks. Not an inch for the Turks. Italian land is Italian, and we shall make sure they know that. Alright, so what is this? Operation Bonaparte. The pants of op operation succeeding is 0%. We also vet the French, inflame the Corsican population, prepare indestructible units, so we can march our forces onto the island and seize it swiftly, without major resistance. Operation Bonaparte is insane, many in our armed forces say, but it might just work. Prepare the special unit. Propagandize the locals. Distribute weapons, train the collaborators, but the navy. This one costs the most, let's do that one first. And then this is cost the second most, so that one too. Prep, prep the navy? Sure, why not? So we need more command power. Actually, no, we need more army XP. Or what is that? What do we need here? It's a star. We got enough star stuff here. Oh, it's PP. It needs PP. We need more PP. That's fine. Um, if that's the case, uh, can I hang out then? Grazini. Max Planner. More Max Planning is very good to get. Better fighters, thank you. Who can I give me the good? Centricuspia. Disappointing. And grab some of that too. There you go. Another destroyer is not bad. Three right there. You still have no one to train? Um, okay. Well, train anyways then. We're importing all this fuel. So, we don't have to. We won't. So 
a little better, not bad. What's going on here? Oh, launch operation. Okay. Oh, we need, we need more people for this. Um, that's not good. Um, we need the PP for that. Propaganda is the locals. Chance of success is 40%. I really want to make sure we get this done, so we might not even do a focus then. Alright, well, we'll see. Now we can go to war whenever we want to. Um, 40 days. I don't know if we'll be actually get this one done then. Well, if that's the case, let's go and do this one then. Oh, uh, uh, 9 inch for the trucks. <coughs> A coup in Athens? Athens? Us do demand the Balearic first. Spain doesn't understand the true extent of the Italian Empire, but we're sure that with a friendly letter, they'll soon understand. Well, hopefully we get at least up to 80% right. Right? Maybe? Very nice, very nice. Come on. And we're 40, it goes up to what? <clears throat> active for 60 days um if I choose that okay so that goes up to 50 percent mm. <clears throat> 65 percent that's not bad now it's for the church Aku in Athens Athens is not Italian uh, but it is a massively important city and the equally important nation of Greece. The country has a fairly big opposition to its leadership. We could try to set an uprising and use it to our advantage, but demand the Balearics first. Um, not bad. One, two, three. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, keep making stuff. Keep making more ships. We need more ships. We really, really could use more ships. Hopefully we get Corsica. I mean, we already invaded it once, so... Nice, nice. Grab some of those, too. Good. Really good carrier fighters now. Looking pretty good here, too. Awesome. I want to see what's going to happen. Five days, 65%. Ooh. That's not a great percentage chance, to be honest, but... Come on, come on. Ah, oh, it's been disrupted. Oh, they go to war with us. I kind of knew this would happen. Or I kind of figured this would happen. That's okay, that's okay. Colonel Bruni cursed. The whole thing had gone perfectly. The landing was perfect. The pair drop was perfect. The day should have been there. Somehow the French had gotten a message through, though. And now a massive French task force sat right in front of the street. The gun straight on Ajacito. On Ajacio. Captain Greco approached, saluting, Sir, what the heck do we do now? The occupation force isn't going to make it through that. Bruna, I lit a cigarette. Well, Captain, that task force is going to be followed by a huge French garrison and reoccupation unit. We could try to defend the city, but we just get shelled to pieces. We're going to split into platoons, disperse and live off the land, and link up with the paratroops if, if possible. It's in the hands of the higher ups now. Are they going to send a relief force and seize the island before France can mobilize, or pretend we did this all on our own and maybe shoot a few generals before high treason rather than start a war? Greco nodded. Which one do you think they'll listen to, sir? Bruno sighed. We'll see, Captain. We'll see. Hey, that means we're just defenders. Uh, go and train first, and then do that. Yeah. Do that and come back to here. Give it a few days first, because we should be able to just bomb rush them in the rear. So give us a few days first. They're, they're probably going to throw more guys down here anyways. <clears throat> we'll do this for as long as we possibly can. That's disappointing. 65%. I mean, yeah, we weren't guaranteed it, but still. Our guys are on the border. They are ready to floor it. Oh, and you guys are still here too. Um, Actually, no. You're here already, so do that. There you go. Even if I don't select it, we'll still have it. Go ahead. Go, 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 go. Well, we were at war one time with the French. How about again? Flood, flood, flood. Alright, so they've lost quite a few guys. <clears throat> I thought international. Almost a million. Not bad. Pretty good, pretty good. Demand the Balearics. A coup in Athens. Hopefully we don't go to war with these guys as well. Uh, keep going, keep going. The seventh... Part is doing very, very well right now. Very, very well. Oh, oh, they have this area too. My bad. We're going to lose probably that region too. The Spanish given. Wonderful. Wonderful. All right, so at this point, um, it's not looking great for us and up here. But down here, we're looking very good. And circle those divisions. I don't think they'll be able to handle both sides attacking. There we go. Good. And circle and destroy. It is 41. Come back over here and get some more output. Because we can. I want you guys to stop attacking. I want you guys to hold. I want you guys to stop doing this as well. And you're going to focus down here. I want you to keep going, though. You guys up here, hold. 
You guys down here just kind of hang out. And, uh... Hmm. Not bad, not bad. Oh, uh oh. Oh, crap, that's not good. We do have a carry around here somewhere. That's nine divisions. Yeah, France cannot do a two-front war. They, there's no way they can do a two-front war, can they? Maybe they can. I don't think they can. We'll see. Oh, they definitely cannot. They definitely cannot. They're getting pushed into. They 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 don't have enough divisions for this. But now we're getting more fuel too. So hmm. there we go. That should really help us out. You know, makes them more motorized. Tanks suck right now, but motorized seems pretty good. There you go. Because hopefully you don't die down here. But we'll see. Oh, we we've lost a sub. We did sink some convoys, which is pretty nice. Convoy, convoy, nothing. Two subs, good. Another sub, good. Good. Two more divisions encircled, and they'll die. Ah, they do definitely want to encircle us here, huh? Alright, so be it. So be it. Go in there. We've lost... Oh, not... 30,000? Well, we've killed off 141,000. Not bad, not bad. Air superiority wise, not good. Coup in Athens, let's see what happens. And the question of Britain. What do we we'll, what will we do with Britain? It's a complex question, but perhaps it has a very simple answer. Probably kill them. War over Corsica, it is what it is. Um, since we're here anyways, can we get anyone else? No, this is sad face. A lot of sadness there, man. A lot of sadness. I don't even want to read any of that stuff. Oh, again, the Corsican War comes to an end. Excellent news, sir. We've managed to seize Corsica before the French fully mobilized. Since we have what we want, we should be able to talk them down. They're degenerate madmen, but the Red Hun breathing down their necks, I suspect they'll listen to reason. Brunei's expedition has been rescued and safely returned. Don't worry, we'll be sure to keep the medal ceremonies discreet. Even though it wasn't the best possible outcome. This is still an excellent day for Italy. Our hold on the Mediterranean is strengthened. France's hold is weakened, and the lessons we draw on from this fight will make future battles all simpler. Avanti, uh, Italia. Well done, gentlemen. Avanti. Again, we have another truce with these guys. This is so weird, man. I don't want to spill any more Italian blood, but... Uh, Alright. Can we not take Nice? Like, why can't we not... Oh, I guess we do have Nice. Okay. I would love to have Provence, but I guess it wouldn't really make sense why we would have that. Alright, go back here. We'll do it again later on. And now the Germans are going to suffer again. <laughs> uh, are the Germans yet just to suffer? Yes. I know I'm missing a hole there, but whatever. I don't really care. Uh, just train everyone. Just go and train. Not bad. Um, we can do this stuff to you. Naples, Tripoli. Tobruk? Where's Tobruk? Is that down here? No, it's Anatolia. Oh, that's, uh, Libya. Tobruk. Yeah, it's Libya down here. Rhodes is not bad. Naples. Nipples. Oh, we love nipples here. Um. Oh, we lost a lot of subs. We need to get, let's get better subs, man. We need to get some better subs. Oh, look at that! Oh, we lost some convoys. Um... Is that supposed to happen? I think it's supposed to happen, right? Reactionaries versus... Right-wing authoritarians. I mean, that, isn't that us, too? Sort of? They're doing quite well, so far. Can we just file? Hmm. Well then. Repair the breach. The great question. Ever since the unification of the nation, one great question has haunted the consciousness of the king's ministers, the relationship of Italy with the British Empire. For well over a century, the Mediterranean has been a British lake. This is obviously intolerable to the Duce's plans for European and therefore global dominance. However, this is predicated on the assumption that the British will be actively hostile in a pursuit of supremacy over the futurist dog effers and the dirty Gothic commies. This may not happen, but we must play our hand carefully. At the end of the day, this all rests on the Duce's decision, sir, how will we do the Anglo? Repair relations with the old island? Uh, lion. It's time to put the old fools out of the misery. Final preparations. Be certain of Austria. Seize the passes. Oh, we get that anyways. Okay, that's not mobilize a nation. Seize the day. I, I mean, how much influence does Britain even have here as well? I mean, yeah, I guess they're down here. Come with the nations. I don't want to fight them alone. Build. Oh, they're trying to build a special relationship. They're the Liberal Party too. Where are they at? Um. 
Oh, there. Build a special relationship. Fortify New Brunswick. Diplomatic talks. <sighs> we get the Philippines. We get a lot of people here. I just don't see us being able to invade them. I'll be honest. Like, I don't want to fight the entire Commonwealth. I really don't. But it seems like to do the... To be nice and peaceful with them. <clears throat> we should repair the branch. But at the same time, we don't have any allies. Like, I'm sure we could probably take them on and do well. But, like, I really don't want to fight them. I really don't feel like it. That's a massive navy, so... Let's see what we can do to repair our relations with the old line. We'll see what happens. Maybe that'll maybe be good. Repair the branch. If Britain so wishes, we can respect each other's sovereignty and make each stay out of each other's wars. I mean, unless they get involved. Like, if they get involved, then we're just going to go blast holes in them. But, you know, whatever. Okay, well, we'll see. The on we click. Not bad. <clears throat> Drug down support. And I'll come over here because I want to get some subs. Sub threes are okay for me. Mad assault tactics. And then attritional containment. More organization is bueno, 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 bueno. I guess everyone else, if you need to train, go right ahead, I guess. Um, I will convert, like, a lot of you guys, though, immediately to forties. Because we could probably release them. Uh, these elite mountaineers. There's a good Corsica, though. That's kind of nice. Um, can we actually afford to do this? Maybe not yet. I'm worried that we won't have enough. Oh, uh, yeah, there, there it is. Reset. Let's go to that one. There you go. That'll be good for now. Oh, can someone not give us a, our goods? Central Caspia, please. Oh, oh, also. If you see Texas is alive... That's because America exploded. Uh, Flynn got elected in America and blew it up. Go figure. Industrial concerns. <clears throat> nah, for this point. Really? I mean, doing this one doesn't really matter too much. Oh, we'll, we'll still do Graziani for now, but still. You know, Germany's doing this slightly better now. They, don't, they have, a, like, no navy. They're still running out of manpower, which is nice to see, but still. War economy. They're all, only on volunteer lists. This is going to last a while. 118 versus 47. Holy crap. I might just go back in. I, I mean, we just might... Wait, what happened there? Dex, you don't like us? Guys, guys, give us the fuel. California? Repair the breach. We'll see what happens. And the final preparations. We're in the final stages. We are so, so close. Is this going to go poorly? I, I don't know what's going to happen. Okay, the British refuse. As you wish, perfidious Anglo. Well, we try to be nice. Ah, so they, they lined up more soldiers on the border. Yeah, I don't think the Germans are going to win without us. Um, When does their guarantee of independence expire? We'll have to fight off the British anyways, which sucks, but whatever. No deal with them. Ukraine declared war. Okay, good luck. And after this one, Caesar passes... Um, I think we already have this one done, so be certain of Austria. Ensure that Austria knows the skull. They must know that who they listen to, who the regional power is. Is anyone guaranteeing these guys? We are. Social Democrats, huh? Probably not Social Democrats for very long, to be honest about that. How much can we do? Oh, we have more than enough equipment. I'm going to convert all the remaining infantry here. You guys are, what, 20s? Come 40s. Really make these boys thick. The meeting of the Grand War Council, thanks for the input, El Duce said de Bono, after which Balbo began a speech to his audience. Gentlemen, we have already achieved some success, but we must continue to expand our boundaries. Italian supremacy over Europe is just around the corner. Balbo walks over to the map of Europe and on the stand begins to move his pointer over it. Further expansion should begin with Switzerland. Its neutrality doesn't mean anything, and its gold reserves and territory as a mountain foothold can be very useful for us. Having done away with the Alpine Fortress, we should move west to France. The little surprise they did together with Fiume two years ago must not go unpunished. After that, we can afford to take a walk to Yugoslavia. Having completed the operation in the east, we can confidently say that the Adriatic finally has become our Mare Nostrum. Separately, I would ask you to make plans in case Germany and Spain, in case of unwillingness to agree with our course of European domination, want to attack us. Perhaps at some point they will want to arrange a provocation, and we, can, we cannot ignore it. Finishing his presentation and leaving his point to Balbo returned to the conversation table. Gentlemen, I rely entirely on your professionalism. For in our, our responsible business, we must not make mistakes. Gloria Alitalia. Shaking hands with the, all the officers, Dilce, Il Duce left the hall in high spirits. Seeing the doubts and confusion on the faces of some generals, Marshal Rodolfo Graziani suggested to his colleagues not to waste the precious time and start drawing up plans as soon as possible, assuring them that, that during their work, they will be provided with everything they need. Europe requires a firm hand. A firm hand. A hand that'll beat them. Because they love being beaten, right? Proclamation of Etat Ariel, dear God. Oh boy. 
Yeah. The fault lies with your moldy systems. Your logic of 2 plus 2 equals 4. You manufacture engineers, magistrates, doctors, who know of nothing other than the true mysteries of the body or the cosmic laws of existence. Oh, I understand the body well enough, my friend. I do understand the body. And Caesar passes. Caesar, Switzerland. The neutrality means nothing. For Italian supremacy must be complete. Yeah, that's kind of weird, man. He's, he's, he's definitely a strange fellow, but that's alright. Alright, and you know what? Get some more radar. We could honestly use that for, like, our ships and stuff, so... Uh, do, there too. But keep making civvies first. Civvies first. Um, we're out of... Oh, we're actually out of guns! Look at that! We're actually out of guns! A surprise to be sure, but not a welcome one. There you go. Help, help him out for now. That'll be fine. We'll get rid of that deficit soon enough. I mean, we make 50, almost 60 a day, so that's pretty good. Uh, we could go to war with them right now. I mean, it doesn't hurt us to do so, but... I guess not too. Three sucks. Oh, three, three's good. One is sucks. One sucks. There you go. That's not too bad. Go up to two. And we could go to war now. The Germans are coming back quite strongly. We're going to be going to war soon. I'll, I'll get through Austria first. Let's, let's see what happens with Austria. Stop doing that. Go and repair. Coup in Albania. Or coup stagnates. The uprising has not been a complete success. The front lines are seemingly frozen and does not look like it will end well for the rebellion. It's time to intervene. Yeah, maybe I'll have to wait for Italy, uh, those guys then. Oh, you guys are still down here too. Um, you guys probably do that. Okay, like. How strong are these guys? I'm not going to bend the border with with uh, those guys first. We actually might still be able to do okay. Let's go from Rhodes to Athens. We need to increase our naval capacity. Or uh, capacity to naval invade. All we need is one there. All we need is one. Uh, let's do it in Rhodes, because we'll need that immediately. Tobruk, Tripoli. That's it too. It's fine. We have a of Austria. Seize the passes. We'll go to war with the French a little later. That's fine for now. Yeah, they've actually come all the way back, because they know I want to go to war with them, so. And if they want to attack us, well, our defenses in the mountains are so good. Especially with 40 combo with infantry. Um, I'm going to sell half of you guys a little get, get over here. Guys, join the stupid thing over here. Why are you not doing that? Oh my god, seriously. You select this button. Unassigned divisions. Nothing to assign them from. What do you mean? Oh, you guys are already unassigned. That's good. Go there. Don't be dumb. Good, good, good. 15, 15, 7. Uh, we'll see. Alright, so you guys should be planning. You guys stop training. You guys do that. That's fine. Let's do some of that as well. You guys come up and have a good time. Do that too. You guys are doing that too. But you guys will be done very fast too, so it doesn't really matter. And get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. We do have an airbase here as well. Let's make sure we have enough close air support to help them out to assist and get some planes. Good. We're not really close enough to do that. Okay. Uh, we're good to go. We got one more day. That's not bad. Montenegro's going to die. Was this our puppet earlier? I thought it was, but whatever. Yeah, they're gonna die there. That sucks for them. Oh well, goodbye. Tripoli, yes please. <clears throat> Alright, you should be able to do that. You guys, go ahead and switch you guys over to doing this. Give them a few days. We should be able to go anyways. Actually, are you guys all... Yeah, you guys are fine. You guys are fine. Let's go to war. Oh, actually, is the war not over yet? Uh, I want to go to war now. Crete is independent. Oh, do we not have a war goal on them? How did you, oh my goodness, maybe we didn't. We have a war goal against Austria, though, right? Seize the passes, that's nice. And mobilize the nation. Mobilize the nation, mobilize the people before we march to war. Do we not? Who do we have war goals on? Switzerland, Albania, Turkey, Greece. Man, this is the wrong Greece as well. That's so dumb. That is dumb dumb. The Athenian insurrection. At this point, I don't even know. Like, we're Oh, you guys are over here. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense then. Okay. God dang it. My bad. I should have realized that. My fault. My fault. My fault. 
go in. You should be able to do well with these guys. <clears throat> Please just kill them off. Kill them off, kill them off, kill them off. Is mere 40 combo hits. I mean, they should blow through these guys pretty easily. Alright, 31,000. Oh, that's a lot of dead guys, man. I'll be honest. That's a lot of guys. Well, at least we're back at war. And after that, seize the day. Carp diem. Let no one stand in our way. Okay. Hey, that's curious. Nice. Good stuff. Um, we have enough naval XP to do this, though. Let's see. Read our threes. Enter your twos. That's better. And grab some more of that. Cool. Not bad. Pretty good. You are done. You come here. Bing bong. Bong. And bing. Not bad. Izmir will die, and we've only lost less than 500. Well, killing off 21,000. Pretty nice. Um... I'm going to take this first. I'm going to take these islands because we're already over here. So, I'll get the rest of you guys, maybe. Yeah. Get a little bit more score. Give it to them, and I'll see what happens. If we have to re-invade them, so be it. Can we not? Wait. Can we not give this to them? Oh, okay. That's very weird. I can't give it all to them. Oh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Is there any sort of decision we can give them stuff or something? Or... <clears throat> Ah, okay, so here we go. A goose ended successfully. Oh, okay then. Good news, Luce. The uprising of monarchist opposition led by Gorgios Condilius has successfully conceded control of the capital soon after. Condilius has been captured by a division sent to aid their uprising. The regency now lies in Italian hands, and her plans can be set to motion. Maintain the regime. Cool. Political actions, nothing really there. Okay then. Not bad. Well, since we're here. Uh, do the Turks love us? Probably not. They probably really don't love us right now. Uh, is anyone guaranteeing their independence? Just by war goal? I guess we don't have one against you guys. Well, I can wait then. I'll wait then first. Because I want you all to come here. Because I do want to set up some naval invasions here too. So, you guys didn't do too poorly. You guys go to Adana. And... Maybe Athens? Eh... Uh, that's pretty risky invading, doing it like this. But we like the risk. There you go. Something like that. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Another destroy is good. As I'm ignoring the French, Yugoslavia and Bulgaria. All right. They might come attack us, attack us too. Oh, they actually pushed in. Look at that. Or maybe not. They're getting their own lands back. Nice, nice, nice. We don't need that. So those two are done. That's good, good, good. Grab some of that as well, well, well. California, the state of Jefferson. What else is new? And we're done mobilizing the nation and seize the day. All right, very good. And I guess keep building ourselves up for now. I mean, we could really use it. Finish off that radar. Uh, Sicily was really good to have. Um, come right down here too. Build that up as well. All right then. Are we poised to invade? Are we? We got a few day, few weeks left. That's fine. You guys will hopefully do okay here as well. No guarantees, of course, but we'll see. Death charge mortars, nice. Grab some of that. Intelligence wise, how are we doing? We only have one guy here. Construction five is nice. Let's grab some passive defense as well. And extraction, let's grab that. Cap, more cap. Yeah, they're probably gonna really try to hit us hard. Alright, well let's see about that. Um Are our ships in the ocean? Or the Mediterranean, really. Oh uh, yes, ish. Oh, let's see what happens. Are they guaranteed by anybody? Hopefully not. Oh, they're not going to attack us? What's wrong with you guys? Can you guys actually invade? That's probably... I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, you guys do that. You guys do that. You guys go in there. Graziani. See what you can do. I mean, the terrain sucks. Don't get me wrong, but still. Hey, we actually invaded. Look at that. Nice. Good job, guys. Alright, then. They put all their armies on here, it looks like. So, we'll go on this side. Alright, as soon as they start... Oh, they're, they're already starting to leave. Um, you guys just head on out. You do it the best you can. Both groups... This is a distraction force, pretty much. Over here, this is where we really get the meat and potatoes going. 
yeah, we're gonna lose a few divisions here and there, but it is what it is, you know. And that'd be really good for the French border. Uh, yeah, they're just they still got cycles divisions over here, so seize a day, not bad. All right, is that the end of the focus tree? Maybe. What is this? Nice. It really is more divisions. Yeah, they're gonna spread out here. If they don't move these divisions out, like they're they're screwed. And if they do, they're still screwed. So, wow. One Europe, one eagle. Okay. I guess we get we have to kill everybody. Yeah, I'm sorry. I I just don't know this focus tree that well, and what's gonna happen. So, euthanize the old lion. Crush the Spaniards. We lose a lot of political power. So overall, not too bad. Really, not too bad. Any upgrades yet? Any upgrades? No. Okay. Losses are probably pretty fairly high. Oh, we can't see that. Oh, come on, man. Well, I can see this one. Seventy-one thousand losses last so far. Not terrible. Could be better. How much manpower do the Turks have? Nuclear efforts. Well. I'm not sure that's really going to help you, Envy Pasha. 100,000 manpower left ish. Ish. Not bad, not bad. Anything else up here? Not too much, no. Stockpile wise, they have plenty of equipment, which would be great to add to our equipment once they're gone. Of course, of course. Still a very superiority, which is nice. They do have a few planes, but they can't really do too much about that. Uh, attrition containment is very good. Infiltration in depth, very nice. And what is next? Fighters, uh, light tanks. We're not really using them right now, but we'll probably do that one. Uh, ship stuff. Oh, this is plane stuff. Close air support. I love close air support. But agility for these guys is probably the most important thing. What's over here? Civilian. We're still building civvy stuff. Do that one. Denelli. Hey, Ankara's ours. So, Samson. All right. Get head on into there, that'd be great. I kind of doubt you'll get there in time before they get in there, like I just mentioned. Not bad. Keep working on this stuff. There you go. And Turkey's gone. This is a much more uh, conquest oriented Italy than I initially thought. Nation state of Montenegro, Albania. Actually, war goals Switzerland, Albania, and Switzerland. Two Switzerlands. We'll deal with these guys when we get closer up here. I really want to kill off the French. I really do. They must be mobilizing more. Free trade now. No, they're not. Two million manpower. Hmm. I mean, they're looking really bare right there. And I love how bare they're looking. And our guys down here are actually poised to go as well. Um. The Straits Commission, are you guaranteed by Russia or something? Russia and the UK, okay. Bulgaria is guaranteed by anybody? Yugoslavia? We, ooh, their independence is guaranteed by a whole lot of people. How about the independence of Spain? National Front is guaranteed. National Front. Who's the National Front? Is that, ah. Uh, I think it's Austria. Really, Austria would probably be good to do. Let's do it like that. And actually, we're going to plan a naval invasion into, honestly, I'm probably going to risk it. One, two, three, four. I'm going to land right here and just go push as hard as we possibly can. All right, so, ooh, one, two. Go with that many guys. Go from here to an... Well, there. Because I want to take as much land as fast as possible. Uh, one, two. So we already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then eight, nine, ten. If we can move fast enough, they won't be able to hit us, so. And that's the supply point, too. Uh, yeah, that's not too bad. Yeah, okay, well, I guess they're next. As long as no one else wants to invade. Wow, we spent all the way into Central Caspia. Oh, man, if we could get rid of those guys. Oh, that'd be so good. Hold on, before we do that, though, Bulgaria is gone. Unnecessary delay, what is it? Ooh. Oh, oh, crap, you're right. This is like Goring's Wild Ride. Oh, crap, oh, my goodness. Oh, that's not good. Um. Shnikes. <laughs> Whoopsie. Should have realized what I was doing before I actually started this. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that is not good. Not good. It's alright, that will do okay. We'll go, actually, do we have a delay here at all? No. Annex war goal. We get a war goal against them. We lose some stability. Oh, we're going to need more PP for this. Oh, crap. You you guys are 100% right. This is just like Goring's Wild Ride. Crap. <laughs> uh, or we'll get a war. With, oh, we need more PP. We'll have a little pretense. So basically, be at war forever. Uh, actually, does Yugoslavia have unique. Anyone guaranteeing them? Oh my god, yes, that's a big that's a big group. Um uh, Iberia. Sweden. Far east, far even further east. 
Romania, Transylvania, Moldova. The Straits Commission would be nice. Land route to these guys. Where is Austria? I guess Austria's not here, because we already technically have it, so. Because we should have it already done, but. Yeah, laughable pretense. Montenegro, Yugoslavia, Bulgaria, Straits. German Socialist Republic. Yeah, we don't have it there, so we gotta go to war with France next. It's fine. Ah, they oh crap. They're getting ready to do this too. And you guys are poised to go. Almost, 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 because we will go to war immediately. Which they're not gonna be able to hold up against us and the Germans. There's no way. I mean, yeah, they got a lot more equipment now, but still. But still. At least I hope. Flying formation's nice. Thank you. Since we're here already. Um are you still working on stuff up here? Yes, you are. That's nice. Light advanced ship hull. Actually, since we're here, we definitely need this one. Blueprint signaling is nice. Give it a couple more days. I want these guys to be fully ready to debate. Okay, they're pretty much good to go. Let's go in. They're guaranteeing their independence, but they're not doing too much about it. Supporting the Lund lease. Anything else here? No. And these guys down south, though, I mean, they're, they're ready to go already, so. Not really worried about it. Um, Actually, if you guys could do this. The Caribbean's been called in, and now we're not going to suffer that because, well, we're already at war. That's pretty nice. And we do have 40 combats here, so that's pretty nice. No, don't move. There you go, nice. Very good, and we might just try a general attack, but probably not. All right, so this is kind of pause for a second here. Oh, what is that? Oh, good. Oh, what do we lose? Oh, three combos. That sucks. You probably not do that one, or even this one too. You'd probably be okay without doing that stuff. So. Um, we lost a sub. Well, that sucks. Can we throw some planes here then? Probably throw some. We could release some naval bombers. We. Are... That's nice, actually. That's really nice right here. Good. And into Obama's. Eh, yeah, we gotta start making some naval bombers, man. Why have I not made any yet? Cool. Are we missing anything else? Because we need more fuel. We need more motorized. That'll, that's fine. Grab some more fuel first. Cool. So again, some more radar over here, which will be okay. Oh, see, and I knew they'd be attacking us eventually. I knew they would do this, so. Yeah. This is what happened off screen earlier, so. Not really worried about it. Not really worried about it at all. Actually, we might just use cast for this. Let's see, carry fighters. Yeah. How many? Yeah, we can use you guys too. You'll be good enough for now. Do do this stuff. Yeah, that sucks. Stop letting them secret convoys, you ding dongs. Get in the. Oh, oh, we got, found the fleet. We found enemy fleet. Oh, we lost it. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. They have so many ships. So many ships. How do they have so many ships? Ugh, come on. All right, that's dumb. That's why I combine them all together. Assembly line production, so be it. And grab some more fuel, actually. They're gonna attack us again. It's okay. It's okay. Alright, you guys are poised to go, but I don't want to invade until we have, like, enough of the board secure. They're not gonna be able to attack and kill Germany off without attacking us here. Or finishing us off, so. I'm more than confident about that. That's re looking really good. We've lost. A certain number of guys. I'm not really sure how many we've lost. 61,000 in the past year. One Europe, one Eagle. Yeah, we could do that. Mm, export focus. Oh my god. Can you just please kill them all off? God, I hate the French fleet so much. Keep pinging them. Keep pinging them. Are we out of... Besides motorized... Uh, motorized, motorized, motorized. There you go. Uh, let me buy a little bit more. Go down to f there, and we'll do that for now. Because we'll build up some more melees now. Oh, look at that. Nice. Keep thinking whatever they got. We're doing really well in North Africa, too, so... Sink those god-awful subs. For the love of God. Just kill them. They're attacking us there, which is nice. Grenoble. You actually might be... Okay to do stuff here. Marseille. Because as soon as we can we get there, I'm gonna naval invade. 
All right, they want to attack. That's fine with me. We don't have a lot of divisions to attack with, but that's okay. All right, let them kill each other off for now. I'm totally okay with that. Mm. Do that as well. A few more divisions down there. Yes, please. Yes, yes. It's a little hot down here, guys. I understand. But you guys got to keep going. No worries. Hey, lost a few convoys, but keeps getting some of their stuff too. That's good. Oh, yes. Good, good. Sink them, sink them, sink them. I don't like to say it says sink them when they're, like, you know, on land, but whatever. You guys can go in there. You guys are going to help them out. 40 combo wits are so nice. Ah, good. Good, it's jolly good. We're getting closer, we're getting closer. Definitely getting closer, which is nice, 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 nice. Send the Mountaineers as well. Send you guys from this side too. Smash the living crap out of them. An operative can be recruited. Marco Cesare. Yes, Cesare. Bordeaux. Bordeaux. And then, all right there. All right. Um, enable manufacturers. Closer support. Uh, that's that one. Because we're using carry fighters anyways. Good, good, good. Sink them, sink them, sink them, sink them. Sink these pieces of garbage. They do not deserve life. They never deserve life. They never will deserve life. They deserve to be under us. That is what they deserve. Anything? Any upgrades yet? No. Cool. All right. You guys should be good enough. You do that. Thank you. You guys actually should be brave enough to attack right there as well. Good. Attacking over the river is going to really suck. I'm going to launch naval invasion right now if we can. Um, well, if we can. <laughs> Definitely if we can. Keep going, Giovanni Messi. You're doing a great job. They're still sinking a lot of convoys around here, which sucks, but whatever. Um, a laughable pretense. Montenegro? Uh, let's get that one done, right? Try that, try that. Uh, how many more dockers do we need? Not that many more. It just takes a while to repair some stuff here. That's all it does. Just takes some time. And we broke over. Come on, come on. Yes, we broke over. That's good. That's very good, actually. Keep throwing in more guys. Are they doing... What are they doing over there? We got air superiority still, which is very good. Uh, yeah, the French are definitely not going to be able to hold out. We've, they've already, the Germans have already pushed into Belgium, basically. That's very nice. Anything else happening around here? No? Okay, well, we're still basically winning down here, so that's good. Oh, we actually did an invade. Look at that. Very good. Very good. Toulouse. Get into Toulouse. I need you guys to force the attack. We can't wait any longer here. Good. Attack here, too. Come on, break them, break them, break them. Come on. Are we in? Are we in? Are we in? Or what? Let's go. Yes. Yes. Flood through here. Flood, 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 flood. Give them five seconds and these guys will attack as well. Guys, I said flood. This is this is this is this mod's called Red Flood. Please go. Go. <laughs> um you guys actually go right here. If you can, if you can. Well. It's a little too late for that. Oh, whatever. Oh, God. Oh, God. What's happening? Oh, good. Oh, God. Oh, good Lord. All right. So we're going to attack there. All right. We're going to attack up north. Not going to let up. The French are on the run now. Oh, Beto. Two shot. Oh, Beto. shot down. Beach bow. All right. They've lost 100 divisions now. They're running out of manpower. Obviously, it's going to be very costly to do it like this, but that's okay with us. Albania is gone. Slovenia, we can go to war with them too. I like that one because we can move faster. Thank you very much. Uh, are they guaranteed by anybody? Hopefully not. Hopefully not. Yes, Poland. Why? Of all places, Poland wants to do that. Well, we might have to kill the Poles later on, and we will probably go to war by when? The fifteenth of September. Fifteenth of September. I mean, 
Honestly, just, I don't, I don't really care. They will not be able to hold out against us, probably, so. I mean, you guys can come in. in. Russia, uh, for now, that's fine. We'll get rid of that later on. Since we are faction leaders, that's okay. Improved oil processing, nice. Let's grab some more, maybe. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah, the Germans are breaking through. They're breaking through. That's nice. That's good stuff. I might just go to where the Germans are next anyway, so. Actually, let's get that one done. Ready, go. Get the boats put across the grind. And then we'll have to do the great speech. Yeah, because we need more stability. We straight up just need more stability. Yeah, the French are done. 12,000. Oh, they just got 20,000 more manpower. Wow, look at that. And we're done with the land auction. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And get some more research speed. Thank you. League Solar will die. Not bad. Oh, you guys are done. You're quite literally all done right there. Come back over here and help them out. Oh, Messi's done too. He's lost a lot of guys. He's lost a lot. Which is unfortunate, but you know. Someone get down here. Ah, we're almost done with Austria as well. The two-front attack against the Germans? I think so. God, we can use more fuel. <sighs> okay, so yeah, let's get more, more fuel then. Okay, California, okay. Oh, that one. That's about just a smidgen right now. Just a smidgen. Come on, finish these guys off. Okay, well that's not good. <clears throat> that's not really good. Alright, so at this point, let's get a lot more fuel then. Looking a little better. And then... Open us a little bit more. Ace pilot promoted, come on. I think the French are doing like last stand or something here. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Ah, Polish convoys, which is weird to see, but whatever. Um, <clears throat> almost there. Almost there. The great speech. We really need more stability for this stuff. And by being at war with Poland all the time, I mean, that just helps us out. Hey! Oh, Austria. At this point... Oh, we can see this! Oh, so we've lost... Oh, that was, that was us. We've only lost 50,000. Jesus Christ, that's really good. We've got off 670,000? Not bad. Um, I don't want to kill off the Germans immediately yet, because they could be a good stranglehold against the British. And we all know we don't like the British. Sometimes. Sometimes the British are okay, but they're the British. <laughs> okay, so, uh, torpedo launchers, at least level 3s, that's nice, that's good enough. Um, get some anti-air. Anti-sub stuff, that's super important in my opinion. Alright, not bad. And you are done. Good. We can use more dockyards still. Alright, so I do want to finish off the French here right now. We should be able to. I don't trust the Yugoslavians either. I really do not like the Yugoslavians here. Um, let's take a look. The Intermarium. Third Internationale. Yeah, I really... I. Yeah, no. We gotta get rid of Yugoslavia next. Yeah, the French are done. How many divisions I've left? Uh, up to 55, which is still quite a good number, but still. So I'm gonna split Ger Germany. I'm gonna split France into like half ish. I'll, I'll take the southern and western sides, while Germany gets like the central, eastern, northern sides too, so. Just so that we have a way we can. We could literally invade these guys up here, too. But we're going to need some naval bombers. We're going to need a lot of things to invade Britain. A lot of things, man. Hope the trucks are enjoying themselves. Alright. Not bad. And it looks like we got another carrier. Tasty, tasty, tasty. Come on, we love breasts. Oh, yes. We have breasts. We have the big breast. Okay. Man, oh, they still have not captured Paris. Okay, that, that's that's weird. That's very weird. I guess it is a third international, but still, losses for us. I mean, fifty, roughly fifty thousand, versus eight hundred thousand, nine hundred thousand casualties. I mean, I, I, that's a pretty good casualty ratio. I'll be honest, like, at least in my opinion. I don't know about you guys, but that's pretty good. There's still quite a few divisions, but they will die. Oh yes, yes. Good. Make more destroyers because we need as many screens as possible. 
Good, smoke generators. Uh, I always say I, we need to get something, but I forget. That's pretty short, so... How are they not dead yet? Lil? How do we need Lil? Man, they're penetrating our conquered territories. Holy crap. That's a lot of divisions in here, and they're all gonna have to die. Um, just in case, just make some more guns. I and mean, we don't have the, the resources for it, but there you go. Something like that's pretty useful. All right, up next, reward loyal subjects. One, you get up one eagle, securing the fourth shore. Yeah, let's get that one done. It hurts our stability, which really sucks, but we'll get more stability later on. Oh my gosh. We killed a million off. That is so good. That is just so good. Balbo is a dude. Let's I'm gonna stop making these guys. I want tanks. We need tanks. We really need armor at this point. This is episode uh, definitely lasts me longer than I thought it would, but I mean, all right, they're done. So I'm gonna piece. I'm doing this piece of off screen, but if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we explore what else we need to do for Italy's wild ride. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.